Can I cook a pre-cooked ham in a slow cooker? Hello everyone. In today's video, we'll answer an interesting question that many of you might have. Can I cook a pre-cooked ham in a slow cooker? Well, the short answer is, yes, you absolutely can, and we'll guide you on how to do it step by step. Why use a slow cooker for pre-cooked ham? Using a slow cooker to heat a pre-cooked ham can make your life much easier. It's a set and forget method that not only ensures your ham is heated through evenly, but also leaves it extremely tender and juicy. A slow cooker can keep your ham moist while freeing up your oven for other dishes, especially during holiday cooking. How to prepare the ham? Firstly, you'll want to make sure your ham will fit in your slow cooker. If your ham is too large, you may need to trim it down a bit. Place your ham inside the slow cooker, flat side down. Secondly, to add flavor, consider glazing your ham. You can use a mix of brown sugar, honey, or maple syrup. Spread this glaze over your ham, ensuring it covers all the sides. What are the cooking instructions? Once your ham is prepared, it's time to cook. Cover your slow cooker and set it to low. Pre-cooked hams should be cooked for about four to five hours. If your slow cooker has a temperature setting, you should aim for an internal temperature of 140 degrees Fahrenheit as this is the recommended serving temperature for pre-cooked ham. Remember, even though your ham is already pre-cooked, the slow cooking process will help the glaze to penetrate and make the ham incredibly flavorful. Any serving suggestions? Absolutely. Once your ham is heated, let it rest for a few minutes before serving. This helps the juices redistribute throughout the ham. Slice it and serve with your favorite side dishes. The slow cooked ham is perfect for festive dinners, Sunday roasts, or even to make sandwiches. And there you have it, a guide to cooking a pre-cooked ham in a slow cooker. It's easy, delicious, and a real-time saver, especially during the busy holiday season. We hope you found this video helpful. Happy cooking, and enjoy your meal!